it's Dainty and welcome to another food fantasy video. So today we're going to be doing Nato's Gate of Trial, which opened up right after his Creation Chronicle event. So here we can see here's his gate and also Gingerbread's gate is open. So they often come in pairs, sometimes three, usually URs and SRs, and it's what helps us build up their artifacts. So we can see the stages over here and the core over here. So this is what we're going to use the energy for to level up the artifact. So if we go on the first level, here we are. There's two currencies. You can either use tickets, which costs crystals. It's only five crystals per ticket, but you'll see it adds up really fast. So if you've ever wondered why people hoard stamina, this is it. Most people hoard it for Gate of Trials to level up your artifacts, to increase your food souls um, base stats and have extra skills. So you can always sweep using tickets or stamina, but for that you need to get the three star requirement. I think I just need to adjust my team. So one thing to remember is you always need to use the food soul in your team. And uh, I don't think we need beer. I think that was my Devouring Beast team. Here, let's do Oyster. And the requirements are usually just use the food soul, finish without anybody dying. So make sure you have a tank or whatever to help balance out your team. And there's a time requirement. So let's just enter and we're gonna use stamina. Okay, there we go. Level one victory. Three flames. Let's go. So this is what we want. Artifact energy. It'll help us unlock Nato's artifact. So as you increase with levels, it'll increase in difficulty and it will increase in um, currency-wise. It'll start costing you more and more and you'll get more and more in return as you progress. Uh, you'll have to put down more crystals or more stamina at once to pass each stage. So it creates this thing where you put more in, but you also get more out. So it's important to remember this when you're investing, especially if you're using stamina since it's regenerative. So if we are here at say level three and you need 425 stamina and you only regenerate say 100 at a time, you can't regenerate enough to open this gate. So this is why you would probably want to save your XP bottles or your, your restaurant chests for these, for these stages. Another level cleared. So let's move on to the next level, difficulty four. Now it's costing 400 stamina. We can enter. Oh, another thing to remember is that you are going to be fighting the the food soul whose artifact energy you're trying to get. So in this case, it's a normal fight because it's Nato. He's um, a magic food soul, I believe. But if you're fighting, say, a healer, you might need to be uh, healing and get a healing team together to get the artifact energy. There we go. Okay. Oh, maybe we can look at damage stats. This is one of my favorite updates. So, okay. White Truffle's not even healing. She doesn't have the time, I guess. Interesting. Okay. Last level. Here we go. Level six. Also, you can remember that when you're passing these levels, if you can't pass it, it won't spend the resources you use to enter it. So if you fail a level, you won't have spent your tickets or your uh, stamina. Yay! So now we're at level six. So we're gonna sweep this level. Okay, here we go, now we have 60 energy and we can open our core. There we go. Oh, okay. 
So here we are. I think I heard that node four was the, the one to go for. I don't know if we'll make it. So as I was saying, this is what I was talking about when I said your tickets. They are here. They're quite expensive. They're like 160 crystals, so not worth it. And you don't get that many in events. Oh, the Nato event did come with tickets, so we can do those right now. Let's see. It's the same requirements, so let's just enter using the Nato ticket. There we go. Okay, so I should have done these first. I completely forgot. So now you have Universal Challenge ticket, which is just a general your ticket, and you have exclusive tickets, which are exclusive to each food soul. So I'm just gonna do all of these really quick. Okay, last one. Fight, sweep, perfect. So now we have some artifact energy over here and I think we can right away start doing this to know how much we're missing to get him to, I'm not sure how far we wanna go. I don't wanna use all my stamina because I want to keep some for candy cane, so I'm just gonna, I'm, I'll read those later. Here we are. So with each level on the artifact, we unlock new bonuses to our food souls. Here we go. Oh, I guess the tickets were a lot more than I realized. We're already at node three. Okay, so now here should we go? Oh, I never remember. I guess we're, I think we're gonna try to go for node four. Okay, now we need more. So I've run out of tickets, so I'm gonna go back to my gate of trial over here and we're gonna sweep some of this stamina sweep. Fight times five. Here we go, let's do a couple. Enter the core, how much can we level up? Yeah, I think we're gonna do node four. Here we are. Now you have to go both routes before you can unlock this one, I believe. Actually, I'm not sure. Do you? Let's try it, I've never tried it before. 400, how much is that? Let's see. Oh my god, I have used all my stamina. <laughs> oh, you can unlock it. I never knew that. Oh, I definitely used too much. I went too fast. Whoops! <laughs> I was too busy thinking about what I was saying. <laughs> okay, here we go. Okay, so I guess I'm gonna use all my stamina. How much did I have, like 30, 30,000? Oop, there we go. Okay, do we want this, or is this attack? Is it worth it? Yes, probably. I don't think I don't have anyone at node five. Wow, Nato's gonna be so strong. Okay, if we look at this. Attack speed plus almost 5,000. Plus all of these, I'll, I'll fix those later, the togies. Uh, should I do it? Extra attack? We somehow fell on a really even number, well even, odd, on a really small number. I mean, we're almost, I can't even sweep times five again. I don't remember the last time I went down to zero stamina. Whoops, I went crazy, I went so fast. <laughs> okay. Ah! Okay, I definitely wanna try him in world boss now. I think my next video will be testing him in world boss and seeing if it, if he improves my team. So that sums up my Gate of Trials guide. I hope it was helpful. I hope I gave good information. Thank you so much for watching me. 
and um, I'll see you next time. Goodbye! Also, please let me know if there's something in particular you're interested in me talking about. I could definitely do that. Okay, thank you. Goodbye! <laughs>